It's beer o'clock on me, Lil Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Flying Dog Brewery and it's a bottle of their Dogtoberfest Marzen coming in at 5.6% ABV. There's a look at the label. There's a look at the bottle cap. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. Loads of smoke on the opening. Beer in the glass. Wow, it's a lovely deep colour to the beer. Really nice deep amber coloured ale. Look at that. One finger of slightly off white head, nice levels of carbonation. And a nice, as I said, a nice red amber colour to the beer. This looks really nice, let's get the aroma. Oh, and a nice malty. You really do get a sense of that barley. It's a nice, almost syrupy. Slightly lemony. Lots of brown sugar in here. But a definite big multi style Oktoberfest beer. Let's dive in. Cheers. Mmm. Wow. And this is like a really big carbonated monster malty brew. It's super malty. It's like a syrupy, it's like you put some kind of, almost like a, a it's like bran flakes, but with a little bit of chocolate in it and, and you've somehow mashed it into a piece of bread style shape and you put it in the toaster and it's a little bit toasted. So a roasty, toasty, sweet, big malty brew then. Very nice, very nice style of beer. And Flying Dog for me, they're very good at brewing this style of beer. I had a, I had the, the Fear Pumpkin Ale a few months back and wow, it was a magnificent brew. It was a really good, bold pumpkin ale with lots of multi flavour. And this, this again is a very, very good, good multi bready brew. Not a lot of hop character, you don't need that. It, this is more to do with the malts. So, rating then for Dogtoberfest Marzen at 5.6% ABV by Flying Dog Brewery. It's lovely. It really is a nice beer. Um, I would buy a lot more of that and drink it. Probably autumn. Lost my track of thought then. Autumn, winter and spring. Um, I think it's, it's them, them kind of seasonal, them, them seasons in, for, for this beer. It's, uh, it's more of a, I don't think I would like to drink it in the hot sunshine, but you know, Oktoberfest, it lands perfect in that kind of date range, doesn't it? Uh, the cooler months of the year. So for that reason, I'm gonna give this an eight out of 10. I think it's a very nice brew, I like that. I do like my multi brews mine, so if you prefer hops, you may want to give this a miss. But thanks for watching, put your comments in the comments box, please subscribe to our daily beer reviews and cheers.